Well, time for us right now to give you an update on what happened on the weekend's sporting front. A lot of action sure. indeed. And of course, we've got to start off by congratulating Western Province on their uh, Curry Cup win. Yeah, their 30, uh, 34th record, 34th Curry Cup win, yes. beating the Sharks 33 to 21. We certainly have to empathize with the Sharks. They've had an amazing season. Mm. Um, and we know Kings Park faithful. They get emotionally invested in these fixtures. And it looked like in that first half that they might have it in the bag. Odwa and Dungani, I think over 150 caps for the Sharks now. Wow. Getting wow. in for the first try. Jacques, um, Jean-Luc rather Duplessis also getting over the try line. I don't know what was said at half time, mm. but the Stormers or rather Province came out a different team. I think it was one for me in the forwards. The set piece is looking really good. They battled a bit with the restarts. Um, Dylan Lates getting in with one of the tries, but um, I think Wilco Lowe was one of the stand-up performers in those scrums. Province absolutely dominating. Ciabella also Whee. one of the stars. But Hugh Jones signing off, and we had him in studio last week. He wanted to round off his time here in South Africa. Obviously the Scottish international. Mm. Mm. Two tries on the day. That's how you drop a mic and leave Absolutely. stage, my friend. Um, but an incredible turnaround. They showed a lot of heart. And when look at, looking at how shaky the start of their season was, this really was a show of heart. And it just bodes well. Going into um, Super Rugby now, when you look yeah. at the, the stock of players, Nizam Carr was also absolutely amazing. But every player just about um, earned their stripes, excuse the pun. So yeah. really, really good performance. Well done, Province, man. Yeah, big congratulations to them. And then, of course, let's talk about <sighs> Proteas Bangladesh. A whitewash in all all formats oh, of the man. game and David Miller coming off tops with a great performance. Man, oh man, you've got a feel for Bangladesh, um, but we got to see a bit of individual brilliance, yes. Poor Hashim Amla coming in with, uh, I think, 83, got completely eclipsed by David Miller getting the fastest T20 century in history. Now, um, within that, um, there was, um, there were five sixes in one over, and you can see no. how frustrated he was at not <laughs> getting that 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, um, you just almost punched the ground there, um, but a brilliant performance. I think he, uh, the previous fastest was in 45 balls by Richard Levy, another South African, but he got that um, in 35 balls. Um, that's insane when you put Smashing. it into perspective. Um, but ultimately, a dominant performance. Our opening batsman showing that we've got depth now um, right from the start of that lineup. Our bowlers doing a fantastic job. We've got depth in the squad as well. The Proteas looking amazing at the moment. So well done to them as well. Man. Massive congratulations there. Lewis Hamilton, can we can we say congratulations uh, we, yet? Can we say, finally we can, but yeah. a, a bit of an anti-climax. Um, Lewis Hamilton, of course, um, connecting with Sebastian Vettel, and, and this has been kind of the story of the entire season in the first yeah. um, opening lap, so a bit of a puncture. Both of them had to put. Vettel did everything he could. He ultimately finished first, um, uh, fourth, um, but Hamilton getting ninth, that was enough to get him a, a fourth uh, Formula One champion. He now equals um, Senna's um, record. Um, only two other drivers, um, I think Fangio and um, Mike Schumacher, um, getting more better. than that. But um, yeah. I, I think he's earned it. He would have liked to have done it, I think, in style. Um, but ultimately, he has proven his champion credentials this Absolutely. weekend. So it really was a weekend of champions, It man. really, really was. And I like how Graham just so gracefully passed the fact that Manchester United did beat Tottenham. What was that, man? What one was nail. that, man? That's, what, that's three points, Graham. It's called three points. Anyway, that's your update it's from the, the sporting weekend. weekend. Sport ever. <laughs>